Here's the Moto G 5G, the 2022 model. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos directly from your Moto to your Apple computer, MacBook, or iMac using the charging cable and nothing to do with iTunes. So the first thing I want to mention is the charging cable that comes with your Moto is a USB-A to USB-C. All right. The thing is, if you have, if you don't have a USB-A on your um, your Mac or Apple computer, or maybe it's broken, then you can always use one of these, a USB-C to a USB-C. Okay. Anyway, let me go ahead and plug in USB-A into my MacBook here. Also, take note. Like I said, I'm not going to be using uh, iTunes, but the way I do this is I downloaded this little Android file transfer. It's a free download, okay? I, download, I downloaded this like five years ago. You just download it once, and every time you connect your uh, Moto, you can go ahead and transfer, or Android phone, you can transfer it directly onto a MacBook as if it's like a Windows computer, okay? And let me go ahead and open this up. So Android file transfer, the download link will be in the description. Again, it's a free download, okay? So now let's go ahead and connect my phone. Oh, and, and when you download and install the Android file transfer, you'll be able to see that little green guy down there, that Android bot. Okay. So let's go ahead and connect this. All right. I connect it. Now let me go ahead and sign in. Now once I sign in, you may get this right here. If you get this right here, just tap on file transfer right here. Okay. Now, if, if you missed that part, what you can do to go back to it is you can just slide down notifications. And at the very bottom down here, it says USB file transfer turned on. Okay, just tap on that down there and then tap for more options. Tap again and just make sure that you choose file transfer. Okay, if you didn't choose nothing, it's going to automatically default to no data transfer and you're not going to be able to transfer. So you must have it up here. Click the file transfer. Okay, anyway, mine's on file transfer now. So let me go to my MacBook here. Let me just click on OK on this. Now I'm going to go ahead and reopen this, the Android file transfer. Let's open that up. And now you can see on here, you can see all my folders that I have in my Moto. Okay, so I'm going to go to the DCIM folder where my photos and videos are. DCIM. So let me double click on that. I'm going to double click on camera. And now we can see I have some uh, photos and videos here. I know that they're photos if it has a JPG extension, JPEG. And I know it's a video, but it has a MP4 extension, okay? Anyway, from here, what I can do is I can just go ahead and drag and drop um, these on my desktop or somewhere on the computer or on the hard drive. So what I typically do is I'll right-click on the, the desktop here. I'll make a new folder, and I'll call this one. I'll just leave it untitled folder. And now I can drag and drop whichever um, photo or video that I want to put in there. But I'm going to highlight all of them. I'm going to go ahead and copy all of them to my hard drive. I'm going to drop it into this folder called Untitled Folder. Okay, it's copying right now. And voila. Okay, so now let me just go ahead and unplug it. And you can see my Untitled Folder is right there. Let me double click on that. And here are all my photos and videos from this phone. All right, pretty simple. Questions or issues, comment below. Good luck.